Hey guys, welcome to another Britlane vlog. Um, I'm just using my GoPro Hero 8. Uh, finally got one. Um, you know, I thought 2,000 subscribers. I've had a good couple of weeks at work, you know, fuck it. Um, Mel got me one, and you know, it's my birthday anyway coming up, so. It's a bit weird not be able to see my face, but I'll just look at the camera for you guys. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get a few more mounts for this, like a little gorilla pod thing, so I can set it up on a pack of bricks and stuff and whatnot for some time lapses. But I've got this for time lapses now, so this what the GoPro what you're seeing is gonna be head cam normally, so a bit more fidelity. You can see my work if it's you can call me out if I'm rough. And uh, but I've only got one battery at the moment, so I'm gonna get another battery soon enough. Um, and just you know see how the audio is and stuff. You know it's. They're expensive GoPros, like I paid 60 quid for this Acaso V50 Pro and this was like 260 so you know it's a lot more money to be carrying around site but you know people carry around these uh, these Blakes and that you know Blakes are fucking I don't know what a pair of them now are 150 quid 200 quid and people have four of them set up on a plot and leave them so I suppose it's no different to that um, all these expensive stability levels and that. Mike, so I took your cone off. I took your cone off and now you're crying, so do you want your cone back on? So yeah, all right, let's see, uh, see if it works. So it's Tuesday uh, afternoon now, obviously sort of beginning. Uh, I didn't do any filming today because I'm knackered, but that's um, what we got done, fucking hell. Right, yeah, um, I'll show you. <laughs> so that garage is complete. Um, I've left pillars down because they were bird caging the inside, so I want to make it easier for the uh, ground workers. Now we've on this one as well today. Um, I had to have about an hour off sorting out some some of the fucking finance shit, but um, yeah, we got that up as well. About a 300 brick in about an hour there, uh, an hour and a half. Um, we're gonna leave that now. See how wet this is. If anyone wondering. Look how glistening that is, looks like it's just been laid. So we're going to leave that and point it tomorrow. This sort of gobbo don't go solid, so you can point it in the morning. So we've, we've scraped the back off, all snots off of the back, full joints, and we're going to cover it with Essie in there. Um, so yeah, let's give a wet one tomorrow, but I'll get some head cam. I might use my GoPro today, this is my phone. I'm only beginning clip work GoPro. So yeah, right, see you tomorrow. Washing this bad boy out, always check it. And always check the style when you leave. And you'll turn up in the morning to an headache. Look at that, chocolate milk. Beautiful. So, uh, it's fucking Wednesday. And I'm rough. Yeah, I had a fucking skin full last night. And uh, we're working all day today. Got here at uh, quarter to nine as usual. After eight. Um, so yeah, we're on another garage. Obviously, you saw from yesterday. Uh, we had a bit of pointing up on. I had to alter a wall plate. I had missed a couple of briquettes under a wall plate. So. I don't matter how fucking fast you are or fucking good you think you are. You always make mistakes, so. Uh, fuck it, uh, but yeah, fix that. And uh, now we're just jumping on this side of the garage. It's quarter to four. Obviously, in Harry Regan fashion, we fucking start late, get here late, last to arrive, last to leave. Uh, check it out. Uh, this is over half a tub on five five boards. Check it. So this is over half a tub on five boards. That round to that pillar is about a thirty brick, thirty brick run. Uh, so I'm going to show you how, how much a big half a tub can get you on Connie's. You use a lot less gobble. So I'm going to get to here with a brick, turn a brick to here and rack all the way up. Same, get to that door, rack all the way up, where we go. Alright, see you, uh, see how long it takes us, it's uh, fucking hell. Can't see that, but it's quarter to four. Alright, see you in a bit. So it's uh, five o'clock. Uh, check it three minutes past if you can see it. Um, so an hour and ten. We got 
uh, about uh, 350, 400 brick, something like that. So, um, got it. Uh, so yeah, it's not 500 brick in an hour. Uh, well, I haven't hit it on the Connies yet, but maybe with Dean spreading, might be able to get there. But Dean was just playing a few himself. Um, but yeah, I just don't. Maybe when I'm not hanging, like so. Yeah, it's not bad. 400, 400 bricks in an hour. Or oh, 350. Well, I'm going to call it 400 because fuck it. 400 bricks in an hour. Get in there. Might crack the 500 and might crack the 500 at some point. Big enough run. Right. Uh, see you when. Check it out anyway. Half past five now. I reckon 25, 20 minutes it'll take to join. Dean's done the back. So I've got that on the outside too. He's done perps as well on the other side. So. I've got that and that to do. I reckon half to point half at inside, maybe. Right, get some uh, get some ties in. Right, see you in 20. So yeah, it took us 20 minutes to point that point. You know, effectively half a garage. Yeah. So yeah, check it. This still needs a brush. I'm not top and tailing anymore because on this type of brick, the nice soft also gets it. Um, yeah, just fucking, you know, that's it really. Marshall Town tile setter for anyone. 30 quid, 32 quid on Amazon. Um, getting a seven and a half inch W row soon, that's, that's brushed. But this needs brushing, so I'm going to get some water. It's half five and we're going home. In the bizzles. So, it's Thursday everyone. <sighs> Another day for Doll Bill. So yeah, check it out, this garage just finished now. It's 20 past 12, we're just jointing up. Uh, yeah, and we're off on these top outs. We've got one peak to do, another lad's jumping out of the side. Um, sometimes, no matter how fast you are, you know, sometimes they're doing, you know, team unders, so, right. That's another one up 21. Just rack this little bit back here, just for this scaffold here that's coming round at this height, so. Uh, yeah, I'll uh, see you guys with some footage. I brought my camera today. Uh, the GoPro, so I'll try to get some head cam for everyone. Right, I'm gonna get pointing and with some, a bit of a late snap. Right, see you in a bit. Right, so it's a bit windy, so you might not be able to hear me, but we're up on this uh, top part now. We finished off the garage, and uh, now I'm just doing the block work on here. It's four o'clock, we've got full top of Gobbo, so we're gonna work more about six. Um, give Dean, pay some Dean some overtime, and uh, get some extra work done. So yeah, it works both ways, you know, you can't be fucking, if you've got odd carriers and whatnot, you can't be fucking expecting them to work longer for less fucking, no more money, so, you know, if you're going to work longer and earn more money, they've got to earn more money, it's only fair way, but there's so many big layers out there these days who fucking, they do as odd carriers and it's fucking ridiculous, they'll what make you your money, you know, so, right, I'll show you what setup we've got, um, pick it. So, we've put an eight course corner up there, and I'll show you what, Got um, Dean's making a fucking making my butt work look good with pointing. So we've got us, we've put a, a tray at this side because other lads have done it the same at that side. But leave a bit extra so we can lap that full full 450 across to continue as tray. And we've got to stabilise it a bit of timber here. We a nail bash through. It's an old school method. And we've also got a strap here, so we've got two stabilisers for this butt work. It ain't gonna go anywhere got an aluminium just as we normally do on the block work but I've put it to the cavity side now so we want as line running on that side of the block and not this side because it's a top out you know it's getting roofed and uh, and we want it make it easy for us so that will take us all the way up to about that height and now uh, we can get us damp on and then uh, if we've got time I'll sh shove the profiles on the outside if I can get them on um, I might even build a little corner, uh, don't know, show the profiles and we'll run a few courses in to see the day out and probably Dean will follow me around pointing so we can leave just as uh, just as I've finished. So I'm going to get a little bit of, t bit of time lapse now and uh, I'll see you in the uh, next clip. I lost my best friend to 23, she left her body and hovered above me, I saw no shadow, I looked around. Searched every building and home that I found I saw no shadow, but felt a glow 
The warmth inside me kept me afloat It felt like heaven that found my bones And gave me comfort when I feel alone Now you're gone, I'm alone I guess it's time to get better Through the pain, I will go alone If I fall, break my bones I will scream even louder Dying alone I lost my best friend to 23 She left her body and hovered above me Dying again and again I went through hell Instead of death But I keep fighting with each living breath I saw no way out From where I stood Felt like the fire had burned me for Now you're gone I'm alone I guess it's time to get better Through the pain I will go alone If I fall Best friend
it's five o'clock. Um, yeah, we're, we're good. We didn't got five course on that block. It's a little bit windy, so I'm not going to go any higher. Um, so I'm going to put uh, some. Yeah, a gobble. We've got half a tub of gobble, so that'll get us about 200 bricks on the clays. So I'm going to put a maybe try doing another time lapse, maybe a bit of footage but no I've, I've, I've had enough filming today I'll probably just show you what I do at the end so yeah get this fucking done and then set some profiles up bang 200 brick in I reckon it'll take me an hour and then we'll be jumping I reckon we'll be off for about half six ish so right in a bizzles yeah that's for Dean's pointing and set profiles up right half past five
dark nights just don't feel the same Oh, 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 oh. back my life inside a car Hit the button, drive real far
five minutes there, everyone. The camera says 46, but check it. So, um, I was 280 brick in 45 minutes. So, that's about what most gangs earn in a day in 45 minutes. Most bricklayers earn in a day in 45 minutes. Uh, so, yeah, check it out. I'll show you the Dean's just pointing now. It's fucking quarter past six. Got a big, big stretch of other time this today, but we needed, uh, I want to try it out. So, yeah, two eight, 280 brick there. Joints as well, full. Uh, get level up it as well, just for. Cause is that fucking six up level, Dean? If you could, brother. I was fucking YouTubing the. Oh, but oh, oh, four foot out, oh, like. So I'll grab this fucker. Don't wanna, don't wanna be too fucking. So let's try it from. Yeah, that's from where we start. That's from the last lift, and then that's one. Yeah, these bugs, I won't recommend these levels though, they're not amazing, but it's a good day, we've probably got, uh, till the top, uh, probably got another four, four, what's that, fucking, four, three, six, nine, twelve, about thirteen course on that tomorrow, some cuts to do, uh, we'll probably do that in the morning, and then we might go down and load that garage up, if, if they'll let me do it, because some of another group of Ricky uh, who were doing that did that, so I don't know if they'll let me put nine course around it. We'll just get a wage in on Monday while I wait for some table lifts, maybe. I don't know. I might not, though. Um, but yeah, I'm waiting for this. Uh, that's what I did ages ago, I'm waiting for that scaffold, so um, we'll see. Might have to another job for a few days, get some more footage. So we're all finished, it's just gone half six. Uh, check it out. I think we got up here walling. We were loading out. We got up here walling about half three, so three hours to get all that up. Uh, it's not it's fucking, you know, not many people do that. But hi ho, right. So we're back again. Uh, it's Friday finally. Um, yeah, I'll get a nice little shot of this top out we completed. Uh, obviously, what you saw last video. Uh, we're on another garage, but I haven't brought my little donk little needle that I take my SD card out my phone with so I'm not gonna get any more footage with the head cam with the GoPro because you've seen a lot of garage head cam so I'm <laughs> I'm building some more garages next week so um, check it out that's our top out up there uh, we did that side um, so yeah waiting for a table lift but I can't find the scaffolders so uh, we'll be doing that on Monday there's only about 100, 100 odd bricks probably each side um, maybe even a bit less, maybe 120. So yeah. Um, so uh, we're on this now. Uh, let's put an eight course around this. I'm not. Really, we did like ten on the other one, uh, this side, but we'll do eight. Matches the house, and uh, and yeah, nice little. We've got a full tub there. Um, that'll just be a nice, nice high eight. You know, you don't want to be reaching silly high with the connies. But yeah, I'm gonna set four profiles up now, and then um, yeah. I'll see you after I've built it. So it's quarter to eight. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm that sad. So, oh, I fucking missed that bit of pointing, Dean. I'll get it. Get it with your fucking finger. Point your back on. Sorry. Perfect toe. Right, yeah, sorry. Yeah, got to eight, that's what we got done, 500 wick again, or more, I think. So yeah, all that's up, um, ready for scaffold. Uh, yeah, right, see you, uh, see you next week. Hey guys, so thanks a lot for watching. Um, that was the, the rest of this week. Um, that was by far my best week on price, and I'm glad I got it on, on film for everyone just to show show you what you know what's possible in a week with just you know you you know one bricklayer and a labourer um, you know Dean's on pretty much top money in my eyes and um, for you know for the time he's been you know odd carrying on me but it's you know it's still possible to earn sort of like double what a day worker earns um, in a week when you're on price 
and you just got to consistently be down, be putting down some big numbers, and uh, you know, there's just everything has to fall into place. It won't always happen, you know. Uh, for instance, this week, I normally probably on a regular, regular week, I'll probably earn half of what I have uh, in this week, but it's just it is what it is. You know, sometimes things don't always go to plan on price. That's why I always say, um, you know, to anyone out there looking to go on price, and if you're on day work, um, you know, getting like 200 a day, which is sort of the going rate, you know, stick to what, you know, stick to your day rate until you feel, you know, comfortable enough or you've got the speed or you've got, you know, the confidence to just then go on price. Because what I've done this week and what you've seen in this video ain't always possible, you know. And uh, obviously, you've seen the hours after work. I get to site at quarter to uh, quarter to uh, quarter to nine, half between half eight and quarter to nine, and I've been leaving between half five and half six. Um, but you know, that's only still nine, ten hours, depending on if you count your snaps or not. We have an hour snap, but you know, it's still doable. And you know, if you're uh, fit enough, you know, it's. Uh, you know you can do it regularly so yeah anyway guys uh, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next week um, with some more garages alright thanks a lot